Our own webinar team here at Atlassian wouldn't be able to function without team calendars. As you can see in this quote here, it's so paramount to their planning process that it would be their most visited hot page. Uh, they're really power users of this feature and we wanted to share some best practices from them around how you can get the most value out of your team calendars. In fact, this very webinar was planned using team calendars. Let's take a look at how the webinar team does it. By linking Jira Service Manager, Jira Software, and Confluence team calendars, the webinar team is able to create a seamless process to manage requests and plan their schedule accordingly. First, internal teams can add requests into Jira Service Manager. Then those requests become issues in a Jira project where they're prioritized and labeled. Finally, those issues get automatically transferred into calendar events based on their labels. Here's how you can set this up in team calendars. Once you have a Jira project all set up, you can go into the calendar events and add a new event uh, that links into that project. Next, you choose from a variety of event types. In this case, we'll use Jira issue dates so that we can map the Jira requests directly to calendar events. And finally, you set the display to JQL and create whatever filter you'd like. In our case, we're pulling issues from the webinars project with a specific label here around demos, but you could use any JQL query to pull in the relevant issues and turn those into a calendar of your choice. Magically, all of the JIRA issues from your JQL query become individual calendar events. From here, the team can see when various requests line up and they can understand at a glance if they're overloaded or underloaded. When you overlay this with other calendars like team leave, uh, you can get really the full picture for capacity planning with one source of truth across all of your different types of team calendars. When stakeholders need information, uh, particularly around when webinars are happening or when different events are coming up, the team can easily share their schedule on any page using the updated team calendars macro, which is shown here. This will always stay in sync when events move around, so there's no fear of leaving outdated information in your content, and it makes it really easy to have one calendar that you can share out on all of your content and to all of the people who need to see it. So you've seen a bit about how the webinar team uses team calendars. To break it down, the top benefits that we've seen from using team calendars inside Atlassian are the following. Number one, stay organized and plan ahead. Team calendars adds visibility to the organization for planning and deliverables with one source of truth. Number two, bring schedules and work together. Team calendars helps us understand when people are on leave compared to deadlines. Plus, keeping your Cal and Confluence makes it easy to link events from your different content. And last, but certainly not least, it saves us time to keep our calendar in sync with our JIRA boards. Uh, we religiously use JIRA for our backlogs, for our sprint planning, and by linking team calendars with JIRA, you don't have to do all the administrative load to make sure that all of your calendar events match your JIRA issues.